Apollo MIDI over Bluetooth is a new app for both iOS and the Mac. It lets you send MIDI notes between a pair of iOS devices or between an iOS device and a Mac. In this video, we're going to cover setting up the Mac to communicate with an iOS device. The first step is to open Audio MIDI Setup. This is the Mac MIDI configuration utility. Find that with the Finder, and then open up the MIDI configuration window. From there, double-click on the red IAC driver button, and then you can configure the driver. Make sure you have one port defined, and the driver is online. Next, we'll start Apollo on both the Mac and the iOS device. The iOS device should be the A endpoint. Tap the search button on both, and they will connect. Once the iOS device and the Mac are connected, you can send mini notes in either direction. Sending notes from the iOS device to GarageBand is a great way to start out. Apollo makes it possible to do any of the things you would normally do with MIDI, but between devices. You can use a keyboard connected to your Mac and play an iOS synth, or use an iOS touch-based MIDI app and send notes to the Mac. You can use the iOS device as a sequencer or vice versa, and it can even sometimes make guitar players look cool. A little bit of the fine print, Apollo uses Bluetooth LE, which is only available on the iPad 3, 4, Air, and Mini, and the iPhone 4S and newer. Newer Macs support Bluetooth LE, but you might need a USB adapter for older Macs. Apollo is available now in both the iOS and Mac app stores.